Hello? Oh, okay, yeah, alright. <laughs> alright, we're back. Um, onto the Initiates Island, where we will be doing the uh, final puzzle of this area. Sorry, is my mouse working? It is. Uh, Lazy River. It is the single five bean puzzle in this area. Uh, and our goal is is deceptively simple. I think we're supposed to just have a... Mm, have one of you guys move to here. I mean, but obviously it's not that simple, right? Because not only, yeah, so a red bean forms a roller. Not only do we need a roller to be in the midpoint of the section, which already seems very tricky, we also need it to stop here. And we can do that with bombs, somehow? So how do I think I want to start this? Well... Okay. Now how are we supposed to have something stop here? We can obviously have... Something roll and hit another roller, that's one option, or I can hit a bomb but the bomb will bounce back and hit and explode oh maybe that's good though because when it explodes it turns back into its beans right which can then allow me to shoot it without it moving alright so then that is our goal which is to number one place a bean uh, a yellow bean in one of these form the bomb or uh, no, have a roller be here, move towards the bean, shoot the bean, uh, the yellow bean becomes a bomb, hits the bomb. That's a lot of weird mechanisms there. So I'm not sure if that's actually possible. It could be though. Definitely could be. You know what would actually be better? If I had a roller along this axis, then this bomb would be in the perfect spot. So I need a roller here. How would I do that? Well, I could have a roller up here. And then... Have this roller stop it. Now this roller can come down to here. This roller will also do that. But it's fine because I can move you back up if I need to. Okay, let's move you back up. Sorry for the flash flashing. Um, yes, okay. Now this roller can move here. Oh, that's an issue. Well, that should be fine. Oh, yeah, alright, this is gonna be a huge issue. Oh, what do I want to do? I All right, let's try focusing on getting a roller, let's say here. Right? How would we want to do that? We would obviously need a roller here first. Maybe that's the point. And then what is this bomb going to do? This bomb moves probably along this axis or here. So, maybe what I want is for if I spawn the bomb here, then either I can have a roller hit it to form, uh, to push it and destroy it, so the roller's beam would then be here. So for example, I can do something like this. Something like, and then like this. And then the roller would explode and form a beam there. So, how is a bean here going to be helpful? I can... Have a second roller... Be stopped by this bean. So I can turn this bean into a roller, have another roller... Enter this axis... And then be stopped by this bean. Which then gives it vertical position. But that then implies that I need... Oh, but then that implies that I need, uh... 
something here to stop it. Which is fine because I can have another roller go vertically, uh, horizontally like so. So how do I do that? Well, I can set you up to move you here. And that's good because... Hold on. No, wait, wait, before that. Yes. Uh, Alright, this is going to be an issue. Though. Let's see, this is going to be an issue. Alright, actually, no. Let's move you over. Wait, yeah, I actually haven't unlocked any... Uh, anything... Yet. Uh, I, I know there is some uh, save state thing. I know there is some save state uh, thing that you can unlock, but... Right, see, that's the issue, yeah, yeah? That's the issue. It's like, how do I get you to move up and stop here? I think I can solve that. I cannot solve that. Hold on, wait. I can wait for you to roll first. So now you block this guy's vision. And now I can do this. Wait, wait for you to stop. And I can maybe do this? Yes, alright, I think this is it. Okay, nice. Now... Um, now you are good to go horizontally. But the only issue now is... How are you going to move down here? Hmm, not good. Actually, I think we're fine. Hold on. <laughs> Am I pressing space? Whoopsies. Yeah, because now, now you're good to be there. Right? But now I need you to be here to move up. Correct? But how do I do that? Because you are stuck on the outside rectangle, and I don't think there's any way for you to uh, come back without a backstop. So... How will I set that up? I want to set you up so you explode outside of this ring, correct? Okay. Then... Oh, but now when I go back down, you'll be here, which is not good. I don't want that. Alright, it's fine. No, it's not fine. Let's say... I move you now. Well, okay, let's say I move you both now. Yeah, there is just no space. I Oh, no time. Like, the timing is way too hard. Uh, for me to... Do this... And then what do you do? Yeah, because this bean is perfectly in position. It's just... How do I in any way get you in? So that's the issue. Then... How then may I get... Oh, well, now you're already in position, huh? Yes. Alright. Well, that's not true. Because the entirety of getting you onto this row instead. Yeah, that's weird, that's weird. Um, yeah, this is the entire point, right? Because that, that gives me exactly enough space for you to see this. So that feels intended. That feels quite intended. Actually, is this good? No, because... Yeah, how then would would you see me and move here? Is my setup wrong? Is my setup wrong? Okay, I know everything that I know everything about how I need to get a bean here. A uh, a, a bean here seems important. A bean here seems important. Seems important. So let's a bean here. The only issue is how do I get you here without having you stuck here? 
And that is something I don't know how to solve. Is that the single roadblock that I have, or is it simply impossible to do that? Do I need the help of another roller? So the idea is to set up a bean here before setting up a bean here, maybe? Okay, so that seems plausible, right? Yes. So maybe this is bad, maybe I have to choose my beans wisely, but it appears that I can do this. And that's good. Because... Um... Okay. That sets up a bean there. And now I have two rollers to work with to get something here. Okay, that seems plausible. In fact, this seems quite doable, I think, now that we've done it. So we set you up here. You are... oh... Okay, so the same issue, I need to move... Okay. Um... No, I need to do it the other way around, I think. Do I? Because... Yeah, this does not give me enough space. Um... Yeah, so I think it just has to be this instead. But this still gets you inside, which is not what I want. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. Okay, wait. Before that, I think then it's better if I didn't shoot that bean over there. Yeah, right there. I set you... Okay, can I... No, I cannot. Alright, I am forced to move this slow. But I can set you up here. Which makes more sense... Now? Yeah, but the problem is, how do I still get you off? You know? Yeah, I still need to get you off the walls. I need to get all of you off the walls. At once? Yeah, how do I get you off the walls at once? I need to get all of you into this square instead. Is that at all doable? I think maybe it is. Maybe it is if I set you up here. Oh, that's not good. Okay. There's some duality here that I'm not meant to understand. But the idea is... To set you up. Oh, that's bad. Okay, well this is a mistake. Yeah, this is this is this is tough. But I feel like I know where we're going, it's just how do I get there? Do you think this could help? The fact that it is stuck in the vertical this vertical axis. Is that plausible? If I got something here, it would move before I could get here, so no. I, I can't... Yeah, I need something to just be there. Right? And therefore, I would need it. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. It's like an operation, order of operations thing. But maybe I need some extra preparation before that. Yeah, I need some extra preparation before that because I need to get two of these off the walls before I get the third one off the walls. So, okay. Uh, do I need to choose my beans more wisely? Maybe this one? 
first? Maybe these two first? How is that helpful? Okay, well, we certainly cannot do that. Uh... Hold on. Yes, hold on. Okay. Uh... Okay. Yeah, let's set you both up. And the idea is supposedly that, hopefully, when I do something like this... Hmm... Oh, wait, no, hold on, hold on. This looks somewhat close. Now that I have all of you alive and together. This one still seems wrong. Somehow. Right, because how do I get you out of the box? You are stuck. Unless I was... Able to... Yeah, no, it's not possible. Because I'm on the outside ring. That's also not good. I don't want to... Well, maybe I do want to destroy multiple things with the bomb. Yeah, because I was thinking, could you destroy... Yeah, maybe that is what I want. Is it possible that that is in fact what I want? Yes, I do want to destroy... Okay, another, yeah, another solution would involve destroying you as well. Right? Because that, that seems very plausible at this point in time. It's just, is it possible? And I, I want to know if it is. This also feels like it's barely enough time. Or exactly enough time to do what I want to do. I can't go underneath because then you are just out of sync. Which makes ac actually no sense. And then I don't want you there either. I don't want you to move up, but you do, because, you know, uh, yeah. But then... Hmm. Okay, what if... I did something like this? Is this the same... Is this the same idea? It does appear to be the same idea, but is that better in some way? What happens now? Hmm, nothing good. And the bean is really not in a good spot either. It does really appear that I have to do it in the other way. Uh... Hmm, well... Hold on. Yeah, no, your, your explosion radius is still not big enough. But, I mean, 
It is, it is possible, right? Is it possible is what I want to know. Is it possible? It's tantalizingly close, that's what it is. Yeah, as long as I destroy that, we're done. Maybe, probably. Wrong animal. Alright, so... Can I get you in a good spot? Doesn't look like I can. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on, hold on. This destroys something, I'm pretty sure. It does. Okay. Um, now, is that good? I think it is. I think we may or may not have it. Okay. So, now you act as a backstop. Okay. That does not explain how I'm going to get a bean here. But this is progress, maybe. If I can if I can do the same thing in this position, that would be nice. This requires a three row of you though. One, two, three... Still not really possible. I mean, yeah, that certainly looks like progress. That looks like progress. Oh, I'm trying to push downwards. You see what I mean? Well, now you're in a different position. Yeah, that's where the bean last was. Um, uh, I want to say that's helpful. It doesn't look helpful at all, though. We have like a lot of ideas, but none of them seem to work unless we probably like use some combination of those techniques together. Like, for example, yeah, we know our goal. Maybe. We want to do that while we just did, but with this bean instead. So the bomb is probably going to explode in the same place it is now. An explosion range will be here, which then means that at the very least another one must be here. And that would in fact I think solve the entire issue because then both bean uh, because then both rollers can be contained in this uh, square instead of this rectangle. I think this is a square, it looks like a square. Uh, but how? Because, yeah, this bomb is not gonna hit it. Right? It's gonna... It's gonna... It's gonna... It's gonna explode here. So how do I get this to be here while that is doing it? Feels like I need to delay this guy's roll. 
But that means I need to uh, enter from the other side though. But how do I enter from the other side? Because now when I come back through here, it's going to roll towards me. This is not enough to stop it from doing that, yeah. Unless I used another bean as some sort of... Something like that? Yeah, because I can't shoot it at all. I pray I press the restart button <laughs> on an accident. Um, wow, yeah, this one's hard. This one's really hard. How long have I spent? Around... Uh, around 20 minutes. Why is this one okay? I mean, to be fair, it is a five bean puzzle, so they gotta make it as shiny as possible. We get, I get the solution path. I just don't get the exact steps required. I get generally what I need to do. Maybe, maybe, maybe I do. I don't know. Is my goal actually being here and being here? Because that suddenly seems like it, implying that we need. All three beans in this square, which I have not yet been able to do. I haven't yet been able to make all three beans in this square. Have I? Okay, well, I have an idea. Well, it's not- maybe it's the same thing that I've done before. Maybe it is exactly the, what I've done before. So the idea is I don't actually put- I don't actually spawn that bean. Oh no, I have gotten- I have gotten all three beans. I have gotten all three beans before, and this- basically does the same thing, but how in the world am I then supposed to... Yeah, how am, I, how am I supposed to convert this into a bean here? Like it just seems impossible afterwards. Unless I can somehow... Alright, hold on. Unless I can somehow cause vertical action. Okay, can I do something like this? No, it blocks me. That is horrible. Uh. I'm just saying it might be possible. Just kidding, it may, it's actually not possible, is it? Yeah. Because it's a square, it's essentially a square. It's even worse than a square, maybe. But how, yeah, yeah, yeah. how? Now that they're both in here, can I use this bean to help? Maybe. Maybe I can. Okay, hold on, watch this. Yeah, 
Yeah, both beans now. Oh, yeah, essentially all beans. At this point. At this point. Huh. No, it doesn't look right. Yeah, maybe this is failed? I don't know. Yeah, this does look quite failed. It's just how? How am I supposed to get a bean there? Oh. Oh. I can get I can get all three guys in the square. I can get all three rollers in the square. But none of them can go anywhere further in than, you know, the boundary of the square. That is because the only area I would which uh, a bean could come here naturally would be to be from here but that then implies it must be stoppered by or uh, backstopped by a bean uh, a roller here is the volume loud all right whatever um uh, just a bean uh, a stopper has to be there to stop you but then where can you go for you to get out you need to be either you need to be backstopped by something else or destroyed in this in the radius of this bomb but if you want to be destroyed in the race of this bomb, you need to be in one of these three squares while rolling. Which is just... Is that possible? It may be possible if... I came down... From here. Like, from here? Roller starts rolling. Come up here, roller starts rolling. That would be probably possible but I can't walk down here without getting you agitated and moving down here unless I already have another roller here which then poses the exact same problem right okay yeah so um possible solution to issue have three rollers all on the same short side of the rectangle Let's see how that pans out. So we got the two of you. We got the two of you. We got the three of you. Now I want you from the bottom. But, okay, see, so this destroys one of them. Oh, it actually doesn't. Hold on. Oh, that's not good, is it? It doesn't even, doesn't even do it. Yeah, it needs to be so much later. Alright, wait. Since it actually needs to be later, then we do have some time. Hold on, we gotta wait some more. Okay, we gotta wait even more. Yeah, so we got a ball. We got one there. But... Oh! Oh, there we go. Oh, then you get you get backstopped by this one. All right, is that it? That must be it, mustn't it? That's not exactly true. It doesn't have to. See this? This is all trivial because we figured this out a long time ago, and then now you you are here. Then this, and then and then and then watch this. Yeah, this was the entire this was the entire solution I've been looking up. So the entire thing was just an issue with how to get all three into the square with one bean here and one bean here. But now we're done. So if you want to see, uh, I had absolutely no um uh reason. I had no logic in mind whenever I figure this out. But I guess it just worked out because I haven't thought of this idea <laughs> that you could be stopped by this because. How was I supposed to have thought about that? That was so far ahead in the, the future. But yeah, alright, that is apparently an actually sound solution. Which is great, honestly. And I think there's just enough space for everything to fit. Which I, haven't, I hadn't even thought about. But I guess the space was just barely enough for everything. Yeah, there we go. Wow. Okay, I, I, will, I will say this is a good puzzle in the fact that it, it is very, very involved. 
And there we go. Okay. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice. Look at that. We finished every single puzzle in here. So I think that means that we are done with this island. Which is great. Very good. Very cool. Nice. Alright. There we have it. Oh, I didn't read the... Oh, okay. It's fine. Island completed and mastered. Congratu congratulations, Initiate. With this ritual, you finish your work on the Initiate's Island. Just as the roller charges blindly ahead, so shall your zeal for knowledge carry you through the rest of your training. Just as the bomb explodes on contact, so shall your wisdom expand through your work in the temple. Um, my wisdom shall expand with a radius of exactly one. The first phase of your training is now complete. Okay, wow, that's cool. Alright, so to get back, I probably need to use the teleporter at the very beginning. Uh, yeah, there we go. This should bring me back to the temple. Yes, right? Yeah, alright. And there we go, yes, so... That that was done, we're done. Right? Oh... Oh, this is, this is, this shows me where I am, alright. Um. Okay. Well, I guess this was open a long time ago, actually. That was open quite a long time ago. Oh! Hi, bunny. Oh, up there it is. Okay, a new world with hexagon switches. A wooden table. Huh, you don't say. And then we got like, yeah, we got other rooms as well. Um, so if you see, yeah, 19 out of 19 levels. Oh, these are the only two rooms I can access from this point? What about this one? Oh, I can. I'm dumb. Alright. Anyway. Yeah, let's let's do some reading before we uh, continue. Maybe I'll just leave this as a single episode. It's quite cool how I solved that puzzle. Anyway, um, from Michelle Koryama, ooh, J Japanese, I think. From Michelle Koryama, uh, M Koryama at Tradition Project B in two Tradition Project on site. Subject books. Oh, okay, I can scroll. Wait, is that? Um, hi everyone. Just wondering if you could maybe come up with some sort of system for keeping the books organized. I was looking for a copy of Shapiro Shapiro and Totally Today, and I didn't find it until I looked on top of the fridge in the storage room. I'm not interested in blaming anyone, but maybe we could all start writing something down somewhere where we take something out of the library. I'm totally open to ideas here. Yeah, that that is how normal library works. Uh, oh wow, Charlene Dalton did write a book. A comprehensive history on the tradition of the beans. An introduction to bean mechanics, volume one, the primary colors. By Martin Cheng and Charlene, Charlene Dalton. This one's by Joseph K. Lee. Uh, okay, empty wooden table and pink urn. Short pink urn. A wooden table, there's a crack in the right front leg. Ooh, and then a whole like museum kind of thing here with this thing. Let's go. Like, like a, look at this tree stump. Oh, I can't actually see what this tapestry is about. How about this one? Also, you can hear, this, you can hear the tapping. You can hear the feet tapping. Uh, oh, I can read. Wow. Less destructive and other specimens presents opportunity for study in laboratory. Possible relationship between behavior and bean color. More data is necessary here. Oh, that's the, that's the uh, tree. That's the tree stump. This one's the bomb. Uh, what is it? Yellow bean into bomb. Red, blue into bomb. Then bomb explodes. Okay. Variation in bean pattern still lacks unifying explanation here and elsewhere. Vocalization, vocalization, so they actually make sounds. Indicate awareness of impending explosion. No, oh, that's so sad. Though no efforts made to stop it. Oh, <laughs> it's just impending doom. Short time between awakening and death leaves reproduction a mystery. Yeah, well, as Frank said, I don't think they do reproduce. Remarkable gyroscopic st stability while rolling. Curiously reacts only to humans and is indifferent to others of its kind. Evidence of designed behavior. Interesting. Uh, example 3. Red plus red in puzzle 1 equals red plus yellow in puzzle 3. What? Okay. Case for red bean base rule above, but R squared only 0 0.47. This is inverse square law or something. Uh, when it's rolling, you get out of the way. Okay. <laughs> I knew that. Boring talk, stop talking, boring talk, stop talking, boring talk, stop talking. Alright, I guess people are starting to get kind of bored. Yeah. Uh, vestigial structure for holding more than one bean. No idea what that means. Speculative, more research required. Hydrophobia. Okay, that's a bomb. Adaptation to adverse reaction between water and exploding chemicals. Exploding chemicals. Hmm, maybe. Maybe. Dear, uh, oh, oh, Franklin Phillips. So his full name is Franklin Phillips. To Marjorie, Marjorie Jackson Phillips. Oh, beanmail.bean. Bean mom. <laughs> Just arrived, miss you already. 
Dear mom, we've finally finished unpacking everything, so I finally have time to send this email. I'm sorry I didn't write sooner, but there really wasn't time at all. We've spent the whole time since we got to the temple setting up stuff up, and last night I just went straight to bed once we were done. But we're already now, me and the rest of the team and Professor Dalton, everyone calls us Charlene, but I still just can't do it. Anyway, I'm super excited about this project, even more now that we're finally here. Uh, Professor Dalton has so many great ideas for stuff to look at while we're here, but we're gonna start use looking at the teleporters that guns used to go to the islands. It's so crazy to me that they managed to create all this technology without anyone else knowing it even existed. Yeah, like we don't, we, we can't even teleport. Uh, but also, um, I still feel so lucky that I got the chance to do this. I didn't even think I'd get into college, and now I'm studying tr the tradition of the beans, like with like the best team in the world. But I miss you all. Tell that and carry high for me. Love you, Frank. All right, that's cool. It's it's so funny that everything else is just one liners about like like monster behavior and this one's this one's uh, an email from a son to his mom. Ninety puzzles. I need to do ninety puzzles to unlock this area. What? I assume it's here. Or maybe it's here. And then there are a bunch more stuff here. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's all that we have to read. Oh oh yeah, okay. That's all that we have to read, yeah. That is in fact all that we have to read. Oh, more urns. This one's a short pink urn. Yep, this one's a tall. A tall pink urn with a curious shape. Oh, is that a Klein bottle? That looks like a Klein bottle. I think that's a reference. That may be a reference. 75, 55. And then we want to go up there. Alright, so this is the next. Oh, oh, look. There is uh, an en engraving of the moss on the wall. Uh, anyway, yeah. Anyway, this is where the next uh, island will be. So, yeah, stay tuned for that. See ya.